welcome back. So last time we had unearthed the teleporter by using the two iron keys. So three we go. What I thought was skellies walking around, in fact, ended up not being skellies. They it was just the sound of the teleporter. Now what does this say? This says scroll of poison bolt and tells you exactly what to do for it. That's good. At least we know what to do. Now there is a portcullis and some vegetable people back here. Hoarders I think they are. Come on, turn around. He's pretty slow. So everyone's leveling up, and I get herder caps as well. Okay, so I've stuck everything in athletics for him. Let's put a bit more in swords. and I get one extra point and I'll put one of those in armor now the minotaur is also leveled up he doesn't level up, he doesn't learn as quickly which is disappointing okay so I stuck that all into damage and Yannicka I've piled everything into throwing Okay, enough of that. Whew! While well, I was leveling up, of course. This guy snuck up on us. Was this some, supposed to be some sort of ambush? Let's be fast about this. Mr. Sword Guy, you are not doing very well. Maybe they're exhausted or something. And I get another herder cap. Is anyone hungry for herder caps? Tell you, you eat that. Oh, that is very delicious. Delicious mu mushroom. Hmm, yummy. Herder caps. How about mole jerky? Mole jerky seems to be fairly nutritious, but not overly so. And what can he eat then? He's got. No, he's, he's okay for food. Hopefully he'll pick up that rock. So yeah, I'm running out of these. I know later on that I will start running short of torches, but hopefully then what I'll be able to do is just cast light, because I know you can cast light. That's one of the first spells that we should have really learnt. I can hear another herder, I can hear them squelching. That's six damage, what are you gonna do? I'm starting to see the point of this this rogue because she does do a reasonable amount of damage with her throwing and what do we have got here? pit root bread is that it? And I can hear herders.
I'm sure there's something more than bread here. Obviously not. Not the first time I've been wrong. We're looking for a key. Have we got a key on us? I always forget. No. Yannicka, did I level you up? Yeah, I did level you up completely. There's a button there that we can use. And I can hear a teleporter behind here. Okay, let's press this button. I'm sure it just doesn't open the door, does it? Yes, it does. Hey, look. There you go. So, that was some sort of ambush. Of herders. We sort of knew that was going to happen. It was kind of obvious. Boom. Now, where have those rocks gone? Ah, oh, well, there's one of them. So that kind of ambush petered out, to be honest. I guess if you just stayed there... be so bad. These guys are no longer giving us herder caps as food. I don't know why. Oh, there's another one. happy to absorb some damage to be honest as long as it's not too much I don't know why his magicka drains they haven't been doing any magic so why does their magicka go down is that maybe, maybe it's not magic and maybe there is something else to it Statistics. Energy. Oh, that's why it's energy in general. I get it. Oh, there's a super fast little thing. Damn you. Right, let's level him up. So, I kind of lined up the ice magic last time. Let's step up the ice magic. Or fire magic. I know ice magic slows people down, so that's why I'm tempted to use it. Hmm. Okay, we've done both of them. We've done both ice and fire. Maybe he'll come in useful. I know that's not an ideal way to set him up, but done it now. I can hear something in the background. I'm not sure what it is. Sounds like another herder. Okay, that's him. What's this? Some, a tar bead. I know you can do alchemy in this game and I wonder whether we'll find out how to do that at some point. Apparently you can get hold of a pestle and mortar to do that. So essential item here, key. What's this do? Always good to pull a random lever.
That did something. Ah. Let's do... Let's go down here, because then we can fight them one to one. Come here, little freak. I've got eight rocks now. Eight rocks. That's more than I ever had. And what do we have? Fanlanx armor. So, heavy armor. Uh, a skull. A skull's kind of supposed to be very useful because... Why is that a secret? I don't see why that's a secret. A skull's supposed to be useful because it essentially improves your minotaur if you've got head hunting, the head hunting, hunting attribute. I'm not sure that I have. Now do we, does anyone want pants? You've got silk pants. You can wear, wear silk pants. You can wear... Tell you what, I'm going to give her the peasant's pants. Instead of a loincloth. So nothing else to pull here. This was a secret. Didn't seem very much of a secret. I'm going to take this. And save here. I think I've been making... I don't know, I feel like I've been making progress in the game. It, I might be making extra slow progress compared to how some other people might do it. If you know the game, if you've played it before, I'm sure you can just breeze past this place and almost speed run it. Hmm. Nomad boots. What do they do? They resist cold and they protect as well. Okay, they're pretty good. They're a lot better than sandals. So, we'll give you a pair of sandals. And he's still topless. He's still the only guy who doesn't have anything. Oh, I almost missed this cave nettle. Anything else I missed? Hmm. And a spare torch. Does everyone else just collect these torches? I don't know. No sense in leaving them behind, surely. I hear moaning in the background. A trap. And a lever. I always think it's better to activate the levers first. Now this is interesting. As is this. Hmm, so a so we don't know what any of this does. Let's step on this. Come here, skeleton. Ow! I almost forgot how fast these things were. Of course, they're not very good ranged. And I expect that attacking from the front there's less damage. So that was strange. There's sort of a delayed opening on this. Oh, another one. I can hear them. It's 
So he's going to pop up behind me then, is he? Oops. I think that's the best one to use, to be honest. Because you hit all of them in, in one go. Fortunately, well, I just missed there as a bad idea. Fortunately, they're quite stupid, so they like they like having three, you know, hanging around all of them. You know. Oh, I didn't see him. I thought I'd killed you all. I want my throwing knives back. Well, maybe you don't have my throwing knives. I'm sure I used something against you, though. Anyway, that walking sound, that kind of clattering skelly sound, has disappeared. Oh, I've somehow picked these up. What's this? Why is there a skeleton up there? I don't understand that. I'm also running out of light. We could explore here. Does he have anything that you can grab? No. Anyhow, we're coming up to the end of the session. I'll we'll just explore what's in here before I stop. And that seems to be the way down. Okay, I'll have a quick look in this sack. What goodies has it got? Empty flasks, more. Oh, so this is how we make potions and all that rubbish. You need one flask, one tar bead, anti venom, one flask, one cave nettle. Okay, tar bead. Okay, I get it. Shift and left or right mouse button. Okay, anti-venom and flasks. So, pretty cool. And that's the way down to level 3. But of course, we need to we need to dash back and see what was in the last level. And what's in here as well? What's this? Only a patient man can defeat a demon's gaze. What, we're supposed to look at him or something? Stare at him? What's that about? I suppose, okay, let's stare at him. Dum de dum de dum de dum. I think this is the way you've got to do it anyway. Yeah! I wasn't expecting that. I hope we can get something good after we've done all. And I am a great fire of this fan of this fire magic, I've gotta say. It makes me regret that I didn't completely go with the fire magic because my worry is that the, uh, they, they're not really doing too much damage in fact they're missing a lot of the time and that guy is doing the majority of the hit big hitting and what do we get here? three fire bombs Okay, that's pretty cool. So, after we've slaughtered tons of skellies, 
we've got our way down to level 3 but we also need to explore and see what's going down here okay so we'll pause things there and I'll see you for the next section